Hey everybody, it's Phil from TeachBlend and in this video we're going to have a look at Microsoft's newly released tool Teach Direct in M365. Now this uses Copilot and artificial intelligence to help teachers create things such as lesson plans, rubrics and flashcards. So I hope you find this video useful. Okay, the first thing to do is to navigate to M365. The URL is at the top and I'll also post the link. You will then need to click on the teach button and if that's not there put forward slash teaching and that should also bring it up if not just have a wait it should come up eventually if you're on the right one you'll also see now the teaching tools and you can see me navigating them such as curriculum planning when you scroll down you'll see the history of all of the things that you've created as well as some resources to get you started let's have a look at lesson plan so you hit lesson plan and then you will add the subject that you're teaching, the grades level and the language. Now most of this is American at the moment but I'm sure this will be expanded in scope. You can choose different languages already however so that's really useful and good. In the description then create the lesson that you want to make. So put a good prompt in here, the better prompt the better output you'll get. So I've done a half decent one here as an example. I've talked about Rose and Shine principles, for example. I'm also going to upload a file and the file I'm going to upload is a spec. Again, this is all example. And as teachers, I'm sure you'll be able to create a better prompt for a better lesson than I could. In the standards, you can also add various different standards. Again, these are quite limited in scope at the moment, but I'm sure most will be added. Then click generate lesson plan. It'll take a few moments and it will generate you a lesson plan that you can then use as a starting point. Again, I think most of this are starting points to give you some ideas, but it does give you a really good overview on how you could create a lesson as well as some timings. What you can also do is edit them as well. We'll save that then to our OneDrive and I'll show you how that can be used. You'll see on the right hand side you can all enhance it as well and improve it further. But there you go, there's a basic lesson plan, very very simple and very quick to create. There's also other options as well such as homework and assessment so you can create things such as rubrics and again I'm sure Microsoft will expand the scope of these in, as well in due course. There's also study aids and more and flashcards is really useful. So for here you can put some learning content in. Now I've just done a basic one here but the more content you put in here the better the flashcards will be and you can also upload files as well. So I'm doing a term and definition one here and I've asked it to create some hardware and software examples and you can edit these as well so don't think that they're just static you can go through check these it's always useful to do that with AI you know make sure you check these edit them you're the professional but what you can do is you can generate extra ones as well and it's a, just a really quick way of generating some flashcards. If you scroll back up to the top, you can save the activity and you can also preview it. So in this example, I've just previewed it and you can see here me working through those flashcards. I hope you found this video useful. 